Um, I don't think Diok is involved in the shocker. That's <laughs> <laughs> at least two other friends. <laughs> That's what, how you do it. <laughs> Wait, Shit. never mind. All right. Uh, also, Xavier Pinecrest and Sorsha Irvisi. Oh, Sorsha Irvisi? Mm-hmm. Irvisi. Irvisi. Yes. They are both, all three one, of them two, three, four, are five, six, seven, backing uh, We need Areola. one more name. We need one more name. Oh, no, we don't. That's Ariola. Okay, great. Yeah. Three of them are backing Ariola. Guys, remember when everyone was making fun of me for asking about the politics? Oh, and Jesus now Christ. who's the idiot? And now who's on top? Arky's on top. <laughs> okay, I, oh, I want to point out all of the questions that you were asking about politics are not going to be helpful here. Because the votes! I asked about how, yeah, who got but, that many votes. But yeah, a lot of your questions were like, can one person abstain to like show that they don't care which way it goes? And like, I, A worthy question! And the answer was no, you can't abstain. That's true. Come the, on. the answer was no, and it does not relate. To <laughs> <laughs> I um, disagree. <laughs> okay. Donovan, well, how, we'll how, long, out, how long do we have until this? Three hours. Three hours. All right, let's go. Um, you want to split up? Yeah, I'm, I want to go by the. Uh, you got to stay out of Diop's sight. Place, and um, um, just kind of like maybe like I'll do, do that. How like I uh, do. I'm not going to start. Hold anything. on, we got two people talking at once. What's up? I, what I want to try is just go, like, go by and like strike up a conversation with them and try to do that kind of like good fellow. Like it'd be a real shame if you know okay. something happened if you if you decided you know. So Arizona, you want to go to the she's in trouble, Donovan? She's what did trouble. you want to do? Um, nothing. I am j absolutely fine. I was cross talking with Amy. Okay, uh, Amy, was there something you wanted to do? Well, yeah. I mean, if we're gonna split up and convince people, I actually, I actually, because none of them know the the drill yet. None of them know or. Our proposal? No. So I feel like we should target, actually, the people who might side with us anyway. But isn't that the whole point of presenting at the council? But but we go but we go to them beforehand. They're trying to stack the deck. Yeah. So when they get there, everyone's already on their side, and it's really just so really we really we just have three: Lana, Hale, and Kinsley to target. Two, four, three. Kinsley and Hale, I can persuade to side with us. Okay. They've been advocates of peace. Okay, if you want to take, t I think we should split up in groups though, so no one goes alone. I th also think you should stay here. <laughs> if, we <laughs> have, if we have a few hours. I'm not going to start anything. Oh yeah, we could all go together. But if something happens, not responsible. I'm not responsible. Okay, okay. All right, yeah, then maybe we should all go together. So maybe we should talk to Lana first, because she's the head. So ah, I, a woman I ruling. Perlamore. Furthermore, I love it. <laughs> For what I want to do, I don't I'm fine with the gender the group would be helpful. <laughs> well, are you, you going to go in disguise? Would? Yeah, I can disguise myself. I got the. <laughs> and you should go in disguise because yeah. if you show up in the council chambers, you're just gonna go. These guys threaten me. Throw them out. Well, I'm not gonna threaten her. I'm gonna. Th I'm just gonna. The guys that are already siding with. Yeah, those guys are gonna go. Hey, well, don't I, listen wait, to wait, them. Who's, well, who's, yeah. who's, wait, who's talking? Yes. There we go. What? You have to do it in character. <laughs> You're not telepathic, are you? Uh, well, I am. How do you know that? <laughs> I've seen your character sheets. Well, I, I mean, obviously, I'll disguise myself. Yes. Yes. Okay. And I'll just, and I just, I just want to imply that bad things will happen if. Oh my gosh. Uh, Dark. Okay, so who are you going for? You're going for Sarka. For 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 Diak. Sar Sarka Diak. Sarka Diak. Yep. God, that's so funny. So good. Yeah. So good. So did okay, that. and you want to go along. Yeah, I'm gonna go along disguised, and I'm gonna pretend to be like a you know. Donovan, a you're the leader of the party. Do you think that's a good idea? Um, for him to go alone. My concern about this is whether or not we'll be able to follow up on the threat. Well, I mean, whether whatever happens after it doesn't really matter. Agreed. The war. So we can will attack him or not. Yeah. We okay. can follow up or not. My own, here's what I'm worried about. I don't want to get thrown out of the chambers from threatening them. Um, wow. I'm disguised. You want, wow. But that's the thing. I'm that's not actually the way the I way know. I'm the way I'm the way I'm wording it. I'm not actually saying that you need to support this plan. I'm just right. saying her plan is garbage, and bad things would happen if you side with her plan. So Ariola. it's so it's less of a threat and more of a like foreboding sense of yeah. Just saying what like, could happen. Yeah. The Warforge will kill you. Yeah. Well, and not only that. But okay. it's it's a it's it's a reasonable threat that's coming like hey the warforge will kill you not me yeah just gonna well yeah, but I, I do want to add yeah. that that second 
layer okay, okay. underneath. I, I do want to uh, toss something your way. Yeah. Uh, it wouldn't hurt to have some sort of leverage on them, possibly a family member, uh, something they care about. Oh yeah, ask Quiff. Quiff. Quiff doesn't, Quiff has been really. Quiff's in politics, but Quiff would know. But <laughs> Quiff's been really kind of like. Wait, hold on. Quiff hasn't been really keen on the whole like, you know, being mean. Real though. quick, Sci-Fi Geek 47. What the hell, bro? You guys all get re-rolls. Hey-o! Nice. Nothing to GM. Hey-o! Yes. Thanks. Thank you. Nice. Thanks. Thank you, Sci-Fi Geek. Just for that, disadvantage. I feel like the way you, I, I feel like Quef would not be open to me asking like him for dirt on I like this high five. It's like high five goes. Or like, it's, as, it's as far the, as like a family member Donovan goes to hold hostage. Like, I didn't, I don't, power I don't necessarily high five. have to. Or high five. But also Say what it's for. Remember, you can get oh, information could, without being. Okay, like, no, yeah. If I could get some just some information, like names to drop, mm -hmm. you know, like stuff like that. You know, like the name, like names of his family, so that oh, can. Is drop. that what you're asking? Yeah, uh, like. Okay. Yeah, I'll ask Quef, like. Um, what he? Are you asking what he cares for deeply? No, I'm just asking, like, you know, does he have like a family, like uh, <laughs> people that he. He people doesn't that he, have family per se. Yeah. Uh, any that he what had, a shame! I know, right? Everyone deserves. Um, he does family. have a small dog that he cares for very deeply. Interesting. Ooh, that's a weakness. A Pomeranian. It's <laughs> a real it's weakness. Pomeranian. <laughs> Fuck this guy. <laughs> Those are so cute. Uh, <laughs> um, they're almost like cats. Yeah, I would agree with that. I don't want to not use a dog. Smart, though. That's no, that's, that's twisted. That's and too sick. far. Yeah. Sawing your rapier back and forth through somebody's neck. <laughs> I didn't neck. saw it. I just, I just slid it through. Once. Just sure. slid like a gentleman. through right. Right. the neck, and Which, I made sure she knew I, what no, was happening. No, it was a very yeah. non-alignment changing maneuver. I understand. I, I just want to point out that what you did was super sociopathic. Suppo <laughs> I'm in support of it. What, um, what's the name of the palm? Hurting animals. No. Yeah, that's that doesn't, too much. That doesn't seem cool. What's the name of the? That's palm? a very good question. We'll throw it to chat. What is the name of the Pomeranian? Nice. Oh, Don't no. be a dick. Suck a dick. Suck a dick. <laughs> Don't Suck be a dick. dick. Oh. Don't Suck be a, a dick. dick. Maybe that's the dog's name. Don't be a. <laughs> Don't be a. <laughs> Don't be a diak. Diak. Okay. Cool. That's um, great. Great recon. Yeah. That's yeah. Uh, so Why well, did you no want to know about the Pomeranian? Don't worry about it. I didn't want to know about the Pomeranian. You told me about the Pomeranian. Oh, okay. All right. Can we just asked who he truly deeply cared for? No, I asked if he <laughs> had a was. family, uh, and he said no. Yes. Um, Which, he you says know. families are weaknesses. Well, that's obviously that's true. Quef says that? Or yeah, Quef says that. He's quoting. Oh, he's Sarko? Oh, he's quoting uh, okay, Sarko. He says uh, families are weaknesses. Okay. All right, well, all right. Um, listen, we all know that having a family is a weakness, but it's a weakness we choose to engage in. Are there any? Uh, he run. He runs a whorehouse. Is that what? You, um, That's how family okay, works. Okay. Right? Wow. So the name of the dog is Fuzzy Bumpkin. Fuzzy Bumpkin. Fuzzy. Nice. Fuzzy. Fuzzy. Fuzzy Bumpkin. I like Fuzzy, Fuzzy, Fuzzy Bumpkin. Bumpkin. That's amazing. Um, he runs a whorehouse. Is that what you were saying? Essentially, yes. Okay. Does Does he have a, a someone that he's especially like, like a star, that he's like a star? It's yeah. not um, a strange. Yes, question. of course. He, he probably would have. Uh, his favorite girl, but it was only his favorite for the week or so. Why, Ash, are you interested? I'm sure all the girls are interested in that little pussy. <laughs> <laughs> You're really uncomfortable. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay. So, so we're um, just targeting Sarka is he and Lana. This the that's an easy to do list. Yeah. Just two, is, head of state, and you know. Is uh, is Sarka's whorehouse? Um, do I know anything about it? Like, is it? Yeah. Does Donovan know anything about? <laughs> I have Sarka's some questions whorehouse. about the whorehouse. Okay. Uh, are they unionized? <laughs> I mean, basically, yeah. Are they unionized? Like, how do they treat the workers? Are there um, scry stones? Um, let's go find out. That's you could always go find out. You're not gonna know you wanna come with too me? much about the whorehouse yeah, itself. Donovan personally has not visited. Yeah, oh. I'm sure you have like almost no interest unless there's bodies there that you can yeah. use. Donovan's not this, fighting. Yeah. This is is this the city that we came from? This isn't the city that we started. This is the city where you came this from. This is the city that okay. Yeah. Well, I mean I can can I work because I'm like an urchin. Yeah, I'm, give me I'm, a, I'm an urchin. I'm an urchin. Yeah. <laughs> How many people at this table have the urchin background? All all of us. <laughs> I have the criminal um, background. So that's a his I have Outlander. That's not bad. I got sixteen history. 16? Yeah. Uh, you know that it's the Velvet Room. The Velvet Room. Uh, you know that the women there are, women and men are very mistreated. 
Ah. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> you know what? Maybe you should sit this oh, one out, Donovan. Boy. Um, like I said, I, you know, I've got a feeling I really need to make sure that everyone is being treated well. Yeah, I really think you should stay here while I go. I think I'll go. I'll come back. <laughs> I'll tell you how it went. If I'll it was, the boss what to do. and then after the vote, we can go Look, just. Look, Asher's take it out. done literally nothing this entire Wait, time we've known each other. Why Maybe we throw him a bone. <laughs> Wait, why, did, why did you just? Why did you just say after the vote? That <laughs> Okay. Whatever. I looked at it up last time. Listen, Barky, we all agree he's worthless. Okay? We're all on board. All right. But, no, all right. Okay. Asher, why did you say after the vote we can take it out? Like you already know something about it that what that I would want to take it if out. If there's well, after I'll check it out. If there's a problem, if there's then a problem. after the vote we'll take it out. Okay. I the must have. I must admit. Yeah. Yeah. I must have misheard you. Yeah. <laughs> because no, the, the way you said it the first time, it almost sounded like you definitely knew that. No, was no, no, I don't know. I'm gonna go check it out. Okay. Please check it out. For I'll me. check it out. I will let you know. And do let me know, because if there is anything wrong with that place, if they're being mistreated at all, I want to know. And, I'm, and we're gonna fuck it up together. All right. Again, the way you said that, it makes it sound as if you know that there's something. If wrong. there's a problem. Okay. If okay. there's a problem okay. together. When you talk in hypotheticals, you just gotta make that. Clear. <laughs> as a team, you will fuck it up together. Yes. Yeah. If. You're gonna wreck that house. If. Okay. Hypothetically speaking. Okay. okay. Right. And then meanwhile, do we go? Do you think we should go and see Lana, or should we wait here for you? Um, no, y'all can go see Lana. We'll meet back. We'll meet back here. Okay, great. All right, be careful. Also, Donovan, mm -hmm. I'm on your side. Okay. <laughs> hey, we're all no. in the same. We're all in the, hey, we're all on the same side. Um, yeah. Justice, right? I assumed we were on the same side. <laughs> no, I appreciate no, you I'm saying just, that. I'm just disagreeing with you a lot today. Uh, a two Good. Where, where, where do you land like? on all of this? Are you just like, we should just go to the council? or do Yeah, you I said Lana's what I wanted to do, or? but that was it. If no one's down with it, Donovan, then I'm like, all right. You think we should Donovan just go present our case and not, with, with the not fact do that anything on board? I'm like, not about, I, feel bad. I mean, what good would threatening people, like how does that make our case we're that this is a good people, idea? We're just lobbying I'm not, that's the thing. I'm not threatening him to vote for us. I'm just threatening him to not vote for the other person. They don't even know that we're going to propose anything yet. So it's not like he's going to be like, oh, that's the people that, you know what I mean? Threaten me, yeah. But, but again, don't make it a threatening situation coming from you just make it like hey this is what's gonna happen to the city from the outside from these attackers okay all right and give it that sense of foreboding and whatever else but don't be like we're gonna kill you even all if right. it's true right you know don't all right fine i'll stick with i'll stick with the big picture big i'll stick with the big maybe picture. lana might be in league with the gnomes if she is, is this who's a bar her, her uh proposal, no no right? um, who's proposing bar uh, what, what was your question? Areola's proposal? Areola is Areola, the one that we yeah. think Don't you think she might be in oh, league with totally the Oh, she's totally in league with the gnomes. Oh, yeah. For sure. Anyone who would open the gates to the Warforge is in league with the gnomes. Oh, she's very militaristic and just wants to fight. And stupid. No. Nope. stupid. All right. All right. So we'll go see Lana, yeah? All right. Okay, Lana! All right. So the four of you guys are going to go see Lana. <laughs> uh, you're going to go sneak off. All right. First, before you're going. What's Quef doing? Uh, Quef is going to be your envoy to get you into Lana because oh, like so he's going to go up. talk to Kingsley and Hale. Right, yep. Do you want to like he, disguise he yourself or something? You're wanted. I always have a disguise. Yeah, I'm definitely uh, disguised. It's a Groucho He's nose a, and a glasses. I disguise that. myself as a powerful sorcerer who's all blue. <laughs> I I I'm gonna wear. A oh. No. You want to wear uh, Marie's robes? Does she look like a cleric or a blue water baron? There's kind of uh, there's, there's a lot of blood on them. A lot of blood. Oh yeah, they were white. Now they're yeah. reddish white. Is there anyone who didn't get so bloody? I'm Maybe sure, you know, there's uh, a closet. There's a whole yeah. There's yeah. A, I mean, so I found this awesome there. cat tunic. Okay, I'm gonna wear one of those. <laughs> a bar can, those? can lend you some robes of uh, bast. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Great. 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 Okay. Oh, I feel comfortable in these. Like this is my calling. <laughs> okay. So. We'll do, do you, you want to wear? Or okay. no, you're a rogue. Uh, I will disguise, disguise myself as like. Uh, I do have a disguise kit. What are the what are the what are the typical clientele that that Dudes. goes? Well, thank you. <laughs> uh, but like class wise, like high class, low, like middle uh, and low. Like. It's gonna all types of classes go there. Lower to middle class are gonna frequent it more often, whereas higher class are gonna have home visits. Gotcha. Okay. Well, I wanna I'll, I wanna disguise myself as like a maybe like a traveling merchant. Okay. All right. Uh, 
Go ahead and uh, give me a de deception check. Do or I need to do do you I think you have advantage on it, right? Well, I, I got the cloak of disguise, so I can cast disguise self. Okay, perfect. You now disguise as a merchant. Uh, I'm a merchant. I'm, I'm a merchant. What do you sell? I buy things. No, I'm not clear. Um, <laughs> no, they're disguised. I sell salt. Nothing. Why not? Okay. I do it in real life. You're pretending not to be something. You are oh, quick. Yeah. I'm a salt merchant. Salt merchant. Love it. All salt right. of the earth. Oh, that imposter syndrome. All right. Uh, you make your way down to uh, the Velvet Room. Mm -hmm. You can tell an immediate drop in quality. Mm. It's far to the outer ring, almost against one of the walls. Okay. Uh, as you get there, you see uh, people hanging out the window, lace and silk also drifting through the wind. Uh, two large men stand before the door. It's about midday, so clientele isn't really stepping is in there, yet. Is there like, is there like a, is it like also like a town? Is there like a bar in there? Yeah, there's a bar. Yeah. All right. Uh, are they like blocking the way? No, they're gonna eye everyone that comes in. Just let you know, there's two guys. All right, door. I'll you know walk by, give them a little like, how do you do? As I how do you, okay, as I walk in, sir. Enjoy your evening. Thank you. Open the door and let you through. Uh, the bar is practically empty, except for along the walls, uh, you see couches and pillows and people, men, women of different sizes and shapes, wearing barely anything draped over one another. Nice. Yes. Uh, there's a long bar in front of you. What do okay. you do? Um, do I see... Um, Sar Sarka? Sarka? Who? Sarka? Sarka, Sarka? 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 No, you don't see Sarka. Um, He's looking for Diak. Right, I'm looking, <laughs> I'm looking for Diak. I'm looking for some Diak. I'm looking for some Diak. Yeah, I can help you. Um, Sarka Diak. <laughs> All right. Well, I will um, so I head, up, be here. head up, head over the bar, and uh, and get a pint. Uh. <laughs> oh, nice. God damn it, Best Picar. What did Best Picar do? Uh, fun stuff. Fun, fun stuff. What did he do? Uh, so, <laughs> um, you saunter up to the bar, and there is a very lithe-looking woman. Long, flowing black hair. What can I get you? Ah, uh, surprise me. <laughs> Goes under the sink and pulls out a cup. Uh, in it you see, uh, looks like a grayish fluid. You know what? Mm -hmm. Do you drink it? Ooh, is it that's like a, a that's a mat beer. <laughs> oh. Um, oh. Is it like a is it like a shot or is it like a like a? It is it's like a pint. Like a pint. Mm -hmm. um, I'll. Uh, you know, tap to new friends, and I'll take a swig. Constitution check. Jesus. Oh my god. Uh-oh. Oh, not not, not that, because it wasn't in the box. <laughs> that's, that's not in the box. That's not in the box. It wasn't in the box. Doesn't count. That's <laughs> <not>. <laughs> You're right. That is in the box. You have one I probably just vomit on the bar, probably. I don't you, know. You do have a reroll. I do have a reroll. I should probably reroll that. Yeah, natural one's not. Yeah, I should probably reroll that. Okay. A little better. Uh, ten. 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 Uh, you stomach it, but you retch really Yay. hard. Mm, that was good. I didn't think anyone would drink dishwater. Oh, <laughs> That's bitch. impressive. What a bitch. Nice. Good one. Can I, uh, let me just get a, get one and I just point to something. Oh, okay. And something that's not. Uh, one gold. Absolutely. Very one beautiful. gold? One gold. It is a very, very nice looking <laughs> uh, crystal bottle. Uh, some sort of you goldish to fluid. Some in there. top shelf. Is that uh, for for the bottle? Oh no, this is a shot. Perfect. Give me two. One for you. Oh god. All right. I can two take a shot. She toasts you, and this is some, she takes it like bachelor party. Must and it be. is <laughs> smooth. It is warm. It is. Ooh. It takes that bitter taste from your mouth and removes it. Go ahead, and you can have bonus on. Uh, you have advantage on charisma checks. Nice. But intelligence checks, you can have disadvantage. Nice. Okay. So what can I help you with? Uh, I, I want to like, uh, let's see, how do I want to put this? Basically like, I just needed to take a break from out there. I've been hearing some really ridiculous things about what this city's planning on doing. Ridiculous, you say? Oh, yeah. You heard about this with that with that council? They're gonna let the warforged in. 
Uh, I have not heard anything about this. Who is this uh, Ariola giggle fart anyway? Uh, she's one of the council members, a good friend of our, the patron here. Oh, really? Yes. She's a friend of his. And John yes. Does he here. know that she's trying to unleash the Warforged into this city and kill everyone here? Where is he? Is he here? I want to see him. Um, one minute. She steps off from behind the bar. And just as she does, a uh, man and a woman wearing very little approach you. Can we help you with anything? They stroke your chest. Oh, Both the man and the woman? Yeah. Um, They've got their bases covered. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And of both sides. Same. You know what? Uh, give me like 15 minutes. We'll be waiting. <laughs> go off. Oh All of a sudden you hear a yip, 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 yeah. As this tiny little Pomeranian <laughs> comes running down the stairs. And this, this heavy, fat man, very thick, oh. six foot tall, but very thick, pudgy, yep. like sausage fingers, mm. rings everywhere, gold oh. all around his neck. You hear a thump. Thump. Oh. As soon as he comes down like that seems like, that's the man. Fuzzy, come here, Fuzzy. Her. And uh, as Fuzzy sits there panting at you, and you hear a voice, Amy, do the voice. Of, of him? Of the devil. Oh. Uh, he, uh, that man's gonna fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> it comes immediately <laughs> from the Pomeranian's mouth. <laughs> Thank you, Best Picard. <laughs> you put me on the spot. I know. <laughs> wow. He, the Pomeranian <laughs> turns and comes to the. All right, okay. <laughs> to Sarkit. Sarkit picks him up. Go over here. And just licks his mouth and face everywhere. Oh. Puts him underneath his arm. It's a Java. <laughs> oh, oh. Yeah. Can I can I put it to chat to get my 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 merchant's name? You can totally do whatever you'd like. You want to throw it to chat? Yeah, I want to throw it to chat, and I want it to be really ridiculous. Okay. Uh, it's going to take about 15, 20 seconds. Uh, throw it to chat. If you have a name for this ridiculous salt merchant, let us know. Uh, Chris Greenwood. <laughs> that is insane. That's outrageous. No one would name a child that. <laughs> um, <clears throat> So yeah, so I want to go up and uh, and is he he's coming down. He's coming down. Yeah. He's taking a while. He's uh, very heavy. Absolutely. Very red in the face, just walking down the stairs. It's it's pretty bad. He finally gets to you. Uh, hello. Saka, you are the man that I want to talk to. Oh, really? And you must be in the search chat name here. Do we have one? No, it's going to be another minute or two. Oh, all right. Oh. We'll just insert it in a minute. Uh, all right. So I introduce myself and I say. Salty McBain. Salty, Salty McBain. McBain. Salty McBain. Salt purveyor. Give me nice a to meet you. check. Nice to meet you, which I have advantage on. Because he's good at lying. Uh, Salty McBain. Here, let's swap out the box. The novelty is, is lost. Ooh, that's a 19. Ooh, that's like a 23. Uh, he, he, yes, I know of the McBain fortune of uh, salts. Of course you Their licks are amazing. Well, thank you. We aim to please. We aim to please. Now, this lovely woman tells me that you know this Ariola Giggle Fart. Who doesn't? So those who are in the know, of course, would know. Now, let me tell you, I've been hearing some things that are not good. She, I hear that she intends to let the Warforged into this city. She wants to open the gates. I, I haven't heard anything about that. Give me an insight check. <laughs> yeah, I got one more. I got one more. Did you get another reroll? I had one from last time. Oh, motherfucker. Okay. That's Much better. better. He's lying. He has heard that plan. Now. You can read it all over his face. Yes. Yeah. Blah, 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 what? No. Now, any, any, any blind man can see how ridiculous this plan is. It will kill everyone in this city. The gates are there for a reason, are they not? I, it's true, but Ariel is, is a tactical genius. It surrounds the. <laughs> well, all I can tell you is. It's known to rise. Up is the is the McBain Salt Company will have a hard time getting their salts into this city, and we will have a hard if Ariola Giggle Farts plans are allowed to go through. And Give yourself not. advantage on that uh, deception check if you didn't already. Super advantage. Woo! Yes. Dropping twins. Dropping yes. twins. Dropping twins. He immediately, no, oh, pretzels, they would go dry. Yeah, I'm, 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 I'm
Ah. Uh, <laughs> Although it might help his blood pressure situation, <laughs> probably. <laughs> You can definitely tell he's a purveyor of your soul. He's got maybe (laughs) ten years left on this earth. Years? Wow. Very kind. And I'll and I'll finish off with that. And I'll and I'll tell you what. If if uh, if her plan doesn't go through and the city you know is able to stay, I'll make sure you get the best deal on McBain salts. That's creating a a terrible enemy if I I move against uh, Sarkid just for some salts. Well, I'm not I'm not suggesting that you that you cut ties. Please harass him some more. You're you're really attracting fat dudes. <laughs> <laughs> Your form of harassment is just saying things that are 100 percent true. Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, you don't need to exercise at all. I like your body. <laughs> 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 Again. Um. So I'll I'll that's kind I'll of just, just and that's all. Yeah, you don't, you don't need to cut any ties voice. with her. I'm just uh, if. If another, if this, this is, is a very movie? big maneuver, I mean, sure if I stood against now. her, uh, oh, yeah, you it could be disastrous. Um, well, deliverance. deliverance. Yes, I trust that you will find a a more intelligent solution to this problem at hand. Just be more open. Just be open-minded. That's all. That's Are all you I'm playing suggesting. Frank Underwood right now? <laughs> <Because> <laughs> totally <laughs> playing Frank Underwood. Oh, right good. Now. Yeah. That's exactly what I'm doing. Let's do this. Um, yes. Uh, just, I'm just saying, keep an open mind like at the not. at the uh, meeting tonight. Uh, well, yes, I will be open to all possibilities, of course. Let's get another shot, another two shots. One for oh. me and one for one for my new friend Sarka. He, he he downs it, and you can see he kind of twitches a little bit at it. He doesn't like the taste of it, of it oh. at all. Oh, wow. Oops. Got a more refined palate, perhaps. Well, I thought I thought what we had was awesome. Yeah, it's a yeah. one gold per shot. That's pretty good. <laughs> what you had was awesome, for you, Asher. Oh well, let's get something better. What do you want? What do you like? Oh, uh, you don't want from the private reserve. What do you I got? I don't think. Uh, he we do player. have a very small cask of dwarven ale, aged two hundred years. How much does that go for? At least a platinum. At least a platinum. Oh. Wow. It's a thousand gold. That's a lot of gold. What? <laughs> Isn't it 10 gold? <laughs> it's yeah, yeah, platinum it's is 10 gold. To, it's like the metric system. <laughs> oh, I thought meant, okay. A it's, a, it's not a, it's not a kilo fine. gold. Uh, uh, and if there's one thing I know, it's the metric system. I thought it was, oh. okay, never mind. So is it 10 gold or is it 1,000 gold? It's going to be, okay, we'll say, we'll say it's uh, 10 platinum. 10 platinum. It'll be so 100 gold. 100, 100 gold. gold. Which is insane, by the way. That's yeah, a lot. For a small drink. How about <laughs> an exclusive deal with McBain Salt? Are you saying no one else will be able to lick your salts in this town? You're going to be provided just to Dick? Just to Sarka Diak. He will be the <laughs> exclusive purveyor of McBain's salt in Pearlmore. Only Sarka so- yeah. And we split this. And, and I'm, just, I'm just saying we, we split this. I'm not trying to take it out with me. We, we have a drink. So we're we're good friends. Sarka Diak salt. Deal. I mean, yes. Orders another shot of the, the gold stuff. Nice. Drinks it down. And we um, clank. Clank. It's a deal. I'll to be open to what happens. Yes. Excellent. Hopefully a better deal presents itself. <laughs> and he I trust off. it will. I trust it will. Good job, Asher. Amy, yeah. please harass him once more. Oh, oh uh, yeah, what did you say? Yeah, you uh, you're kind of pretty mouth. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I look really good on my lady bear. <laughs> 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 Jump cut over to you guys. <laughs> <clears throat> so, you guys are heading towards the inner ring of the city. Uh, I am wearing my disguise. You're wearing your disguise, okay. Um, and me too. You're also, well, are you disguised or are you just dressed up? I'm just in a cleric robe. Okay. That's right. a disguise. Well, you're yeah. a cleric though. You're FYI, cleric, I am, aren't I? <laughs> yeah, FYI, Donovan's disguise is a red bandana with uh, like oh my just God. black <laughs> like that, and that's it. Are you shitting me? That's literally That's it. like a negative five. It's disguise. like a Clark Kent disguise. Yeah. <laughs> but again, red bandana, We wouldn't let black you do that. eye paint. Oh boy. All I right. look like a completely different person. No. <laughs> with, no, with the Warforged leg. We wouldn't let leg. you do that. <laughs> like, you're They're going to be paying attention to the Warforged leg and the red bandana. Yeah, everyone's going to be looking at you. Face. 
Oh is my gosh. A little stumpy. He is a little stumpy now. They're going to say, I think I remember Donovan having two legs. <laughs> I'm pretty sure and, he had And two. visible hair. <laughs> remember, it was the guard that cut off your leg. Well, that guard is dead. True. <laughs> you <laughs> did kill all witnesses. I did. <laughs> just saying. That. Right. that is Donovan's MO. All okay. witnesses. All right. Well, let's let's walk as if we're treating him like an invalid. How is that different than? Me? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. Fine. If you if you want, I can shout incoherently at things that make me angry as yeah. well. Yeah. Don't worry. As soon as he opens his mouth, the disguise is over. So. Yeah. Oh boy. Oh my gosh. We're gonna just. <sighs> I'm. Quaif looks very shaky on this. Yeah. He's riding in his cart towards the uh, the city. Oh, I don't feel his carriage. Okay. I, I, Lana is a wise woman. She will listen to reason, right? Yeah, if she... Then oh. don't talk too much. <laughs> you should be fine, yes. Why don't you lay down in the carriage and take a nap? <laughs> <laughs> that makes sense. Okay, you, you specifically. <laughs> Got the carriage from the Vespa car. So, uh, you guys arrive in the city. In the central ring, uh, small topiaries line the driveway as you guys pull up to this magnificent house, two stories, very wide, but sprawling. Uh, guards can be seen, at least three any way you look. And standing in the doorway is a very beautiful, yet aged woman. Uh, you can all immediately recognize her as Lana, Lana Belink. Uh, Quaif gets out and immediately goes to her. Lana, oh, it's, it's good to see you. Let me introduce you to my friends. Uh, what is your name? I'm sorry? I sh he can't introduce you as a Donovan. Oh, um, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> my name is Attack Rock. It's Bonovan Delter. <laughs> nope. <laughs> Give it this. this man is named Attack Rock. Attack Rock. Attack Rock. <laughs> a deception check. Oh. I would want that to be a character or something. Attack, Attack Rock. Rock. <laughs> a barbarian at the very least. <laughs> uh, deception? It's pretty good. Uh, unnatural 20. Whoa. Un un unnatural. Yeah. Oh, of, of the uh, northern Attack Rock. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. I've, I've heard of your people. Very strong. Yep. Uh, and this forehead has smashed into many rocks. <laughs> you don't even need a deception check. She immediately believes that. Yeah. Yeah. There are scars. Yeah. Mm, there are. Uh, and, and who are you? Uh, I am Sir Exothermic Pyrokinesis. Oh my god, y'all. Yeah. <laughs> Quaid is just like, oh, Exothermic. <laughs> my uh, name. Nice to meet you. Oh god. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> my name is... Healy McHealer. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I was hidden right now. <laughs> <laughs> Juska slinks back. I do. I slink Just like back. takes like, a couple steps back I just, and is hidden. He just, yeah, no, he just like shakes his head. It's like, I'm and not, it's I'm not John Phil. You spell, you realize that. Eldritch Blast. <laughs> yeah. No. Oh. You have another new spell. Oh. It's I do? seventh level now. Which one? <laughs> Other than the ones that I told you about? Yes. Yeah, you get a you second level up. spell. Invisibility. What yeah. else was it going to be? <gasps> I do have invisibility. <laughs> well, I know for that you need some air of gum. <laughs> and an eyelash. <laughs> an eyelash. An Arab well, gum. Donovan has a lot of eyelashes. Mm -hmm. Of Arabs. In case and gum. And gum. Um, yeah. yeah, no, I seriously just shake my head and then I'm, I'm, I want to go invisible. Like I was like, I'm not ready. If I'm oh, not. how long does invisibility last? It's like an hour. Oh, it's a, yeah, up to Concentration an hour. Concentration for an hour. Well, I wonder yeah, if that would be just useful. Just sitting there. Can I just go into hiding then? I wonder yeah, if that would be useful for battle instead. You're going to have disadvantage by going into hiding because there's so many guards around here mm. watching the it's, carriage? I think it's worth casting invisibility. Well, casting invisibility, be, like you... You're being directly observed. Yeah, you. they would suspicious. be like, oh, why is that guy casting invisibility right now? Well, he could stay in the cart. Carriage. Yeah, no, I, this is before, like, yeah. Yeah, before oh, you yeah, okay. just cast invisibility, okay, it'll yeah. last for an hour. So concentration, that means even <laughs> if I do it in battle, if um, I'm hit, it's, it's broken, right? Well, no, you have to make well, a save. Uh, you have to make a save. It's not great, right? Make, it's just regular okay. invisibility. Here's so if you attack if you or or do anything hostile, you're going to lose the invisibility. Okay, anyway. then I'd rather do it now. Okay. Okay, so you turn invisible. Yeah. Uh, Quaif turns to the cart to introduce you. And is... Um, <laughs> I, I think that's... 
it, yes, just these. Yeah, it's cool. Four, three. <laughs> thank, thank you, Healy. Attack rock travels with four total, <laughs> <laughs> including attack rock. <laughs> yes, in the third person. Attack rock speaks. Arky's gonna try to. Do <laughs> yeah. Oh jeez, are you gonna do Arky doing an accent? Yeah. Oh god. As long as this isn't like another Queen Bee thing, we should be fine. Oh god, I forgot oh, about yeah, Queen, Queen Bay. Queen Bay. Yeah. Queen Bay. All right, uh, oh, yeah. please come inside. We, uh, oh, we are you, serving you brunch. You called Taylor Swift, and then I had to. That is true. Uh, that was the first time I played. Yeah, I you were Taylor Swift. And then I was Queen Bay. So she invites you guys in for, for brunch, essentially. Mm. Yes, there's cantaloupe. <laughs> Shit, you guys, there's cantaloupe. Oh. Look at this. <laughs> well, this it is quite a great <laughs> time to eat right now. <laughs> That is a solid That's Quebecois accent. <laughs> <laughs> you sound exactly like a Quebecois, actually. Yeah. Real great. <laughs> Nailed it. Spotted. What? Yes. <laughs> you can tell as soon as if I wasn't even, if I was listening to a book on tape, I'd be like, this narrator is Quebecois. <laughs> oh, has to be Quebecois. I don't know what that word is. I actually don't know what that word is. I have Quebec. raging oh, yeah. appetite for some poutine right now. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this sounds real good. Yeah, when I hear <laughs> when I hear that, it's like, I'm mm, sweet let's chef. get some of that yeah. in my belly. <laughs> I think to myself, <laughs> I want some nice <laughs> mozzarella <laughs> sausage <laughs> on top of some goose fat <laughs> french fries and chef. some delicious <laughs> cheese. <laughs> yep. So, what, what can I do for you? Why, why are you in my home? Well, there is an uh, important meeting this afternoon. The city is in danger. Taking <laughs> place. Yes, XO, I, I, I agree. Attack rock. Oh, exoskeleton. Exothermic. Exothermic. Exothermia pyrokinesis. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I wasn't aware I was in the presence of a uh, knight. Well, you know, it's easy to overlook when you're so uh, taken up with my blue skin. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't want to say anything. I know it's rude to point that out. <laughs> yes. And then I shoot <laughs> like, like a, just a dirty look. Like, like oh. and he, he just wilts under it. Oh. He's going to eat his cantaloupe. Uh, <laughs> It has come to our attention that there may be a proposal to open the gates to the Warforge and perhaps uh, try and end the siege through a clever ambush. She shoots a very angry look at Quef. No, no, do not blame this man. How did you come about this knowledge then? Because we are a powerful group of adventurers. I'm sorry, I can only hear one of you. What? Are you all right? You need some water. No, I'm doing great. Spits the cantaloupe out or swallow it. One or the other. One or the other. <laughs> no, I'm doing great. <laughs> this is terrible. Listen, no, it's just that. <laughs> the best part. Ten bucks, you can change her accent. Please, dear God, change her accent. The, no, the, we'll give you ten bucks. Change her. No, we're, we're we're not gonna use, can, can I use my parking spots? <laughs> <laughs> We've been in this city for uh, quite a while. <laughs> we get subtitles no at the very least. Tyler, can you? It is yeah. officially okay. retarded. <laughs> and we, <laughs> and we, we, we've heard I a lot of things. I imagine a mouthful of like, peanut butter. <laughs> right. Marshmallows. We've heard a lot of things. There's nothing to do with queef. No, uh, just us. <laughs> <laughs> what? I couldn't understand a word you said. I, I, <laughs> <laughs> I said it's we're just She's going smart. for it. I'd rather her go for it we're than not. We're just smart. We're smart. My friend is from a foreign land. Oh, is foreign dignitary. I didn't yes, know. She's is. just trying to. He's just trying to reinforce the fact that Quef had nothing to do with this Give information. Give me a uh, deception yes! check. Yes. <laughs> if if Quef were a traitor, Quef would be dead. Attack Rock would have killed Quest. Uh, uh, I got a total of 20. Nice, a natural 20. Oh, all oh, oh, right. Uh, I, I see. Well, I'm sorry. No, the reason that we know these things is because we Where's have actually been outside the city. Have you now? Yes. I mean, of course, well, no one's really been. When, when were you outside <laughs> the city? <laughs> In character. Yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> How did you get past the Warforges? Yes, well, as you may have suspected, there are uh, tunnels beneath the city through the sewers. She immediately looks to, uh, looks like her second command. He moves deeper into the room, and 
What do you mean tunnels? Which tunnels are you speaking of? They've all been sealed. I saw to it personally. Well, there are couples that have not been sealed. Uh, he pulls out a, a map, a very large map. Where? Can you point them out to me? <laughs> point them out <laughs> the wrong one. <laughs> uh, I, will, I, will, I will point at the exact opposite place where we exited the city. Give me a deception check. <coughs> oh, dang it. Oh, ding. Oh. oh, seven. One more, one more. Who's got one? I got one. I, I, it's, I don't want this to uh, be a, Fucking hell. A fail. It's just a moth. Uh, well, yeah, but it's another game of catch my, that moth. <laughs> uh, uh, oh! It's, it's in my stuff. Ah! It, like, hates me. <laughs> It's just, it's just very it's excited gone, guys. It's by gone. the light. Uh, do you want to reroll? Go ahead and reroll, Tom. I, I used both of my. Oh, yeah, I, I used, used mine. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh my god! <gosh. laughs> one more. One more. I oh, one more. I also have one more. I'm using a different die. Better. Yes. How go. about a twenty-one? Oh, Jesus. There we go. Uh, thank you. Uh, uh, over. What? What? <laughs> I shouldn't show them the one over here. Oh, no, no, we clearly went out this way. I'm sorry, this is my native guide. No one knows the sewers better than... <laughs> 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 native guide, you told me he was... I thought he was a foreign Native diplomat. to the sewers. I'm a lady. Native to the sewers? I mean, she's a... Like a swamp thing. She's a garbage person, is what I'm trying to <laughs> <Yeah>. say. <laughs> oh, the garbage thing. <laughs> <people. laughs> <laughs> All right. Surely you've heard of this <laughs> mis Who hasn't? This, mis 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 this misanthropic group of outcasts. Uh, yes, that's, it's hard they, to that's how the they speak in the uh, in the sewers. That's oh well, right. Uh, She's actually part Otiag. <laughs> <laughs> but you never get it. I'm pretty beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> I like how you've got like almost no disguise on a cleric robe, <laughs> and you've thrown your voice. What are you gonna do? Never mind. <laughs> uh, of, of course, uh, guy takes the map and he goes off. Looks like he issues some orders to another man, to another few men, and they immediately head out the door, to seal off that entrance. Yes. Well, that is the least of your problems. Is that there are holes in the defenses. The fact is, if you open a larger hole. Uh, to try and ambush these war forces, the city will be for sure overrun and wiped out. Your forces are far insufficient to defend your this 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 region, much less stage an attack against the war forge. We have been among the camps. It is very powerful. However, there is an alternative. Ooh. Hold right there, Atuska. Give me a perception check with advantage, as you are invisible. Uh, fuck. Hmm. Ooh, fuck indeed. Nice. Nice. Uh, 27. 27. Uh, you see one of the wait staff slip something into a cup, into a drink, <gasps> and then yes. bring uh, a set of drinks over to them. The drink that had something slipped in it is being issued to Lana. What do you do? What do you do? I am the ghost of the cup. What, what, what would Mark you do? <laughs> What? Yeah, what can I do? You've got 20 okay. seconds. Can She's I, um, taking nine. Nine. Well, well, um, well, minor well, illusion well, well, to the cup. Maybe well, well, I can. Well, would you seven? Or can I make something? Six. Can I make the cup? Can I just flick the cup? Make it seem like it Five. just tipped over? You certainly can. Well, I mean, but make it look natural. Well, like put something you can in the cup. Put something in the drink. No, it's already. There's already something. Oh yeah, I just uh, flick it, but make it look like it actually just accidentally spilled. Give me a sleight of hand check. Nice. <laughs> Oh, yeah! dropping twins, dropping twins. Yeah, you 30. hit it. The cup falls over. Nice. It hits the carpet, and the carpet uh, turns black. Oh no, the end of the drinking. What? You poison you. You're role playing Tim Conway. <laughs> I was like, oh shit. Like, oh, 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 shit. Oh, oh, shit. Dwarf on Dungeons and Dragons. Uh, Lana, Lana and the servant. Attack work. Rock sees Dark Omen. <laughs> <laughs> There's a coward in this room. There's a coward. It's about to be a dead one. Uh, the servant pulls out a knife from behind him and goes to attack oh. Lana. Oh no! Great sword out. Great sword out? Yeah. Okay. It's I'm out. Gonna, I'm going to attack. Hold, and I'm going to attack rock. Attack rock. 
Spider's not using your head. Oh, um, headbutt that guy. Yeah, well, he's gonna attack with his rock. All right. Uh, so yeah, I'm just I'm just gonna attack. Well, that does. That doesn't count. Sneak attack. Very. That's good. better. Uh, twenty three to hit. Twenty three hits. All right. Smite. <laughs> A oh, holy God. light right. comes oh. from the rock. Oh, he oh. gonna get it. Um, oh. I don't think my smites have ever been holy light. I think I it's know. been more of unholy. Like a, uh, well, I wouldn't no. say unholy no, either. I would just mediocre say mediocre light. I would just say fiery vengeance. Yeah, I like that. <laughs> um, nice. Six, seven, eight, nine. Uh, nice. Fourteen, seventeen, uh, twenty-one damage from. He essentially Donovan. turns into like a pink mist. Christ. Well, you could do a subdual. You could do subdual damage. That's not going to happen. Dominant <laughs> <laughs> um, doesn't do subdual damage. I d I do not understand. Attack Rock doesn't understand the word subdual. Attack you, Rock you, doesn't understand sub as a prefix. <laughs> <laughs> so I should do all that. <laughs> but he knows the word prefix. You know. <laughs> right. <laughs> Attack Rock doesn't know what pre means, but he knows prefix. So uh, your sword. Comes out of its scabbard, cuts the dude pretty much in twain. Uh, blood flies back. Give me a dexterity check to dodge <laughs> the spray. Oh, yeah, spray okay. of blood. You have. Oh, pretty good. Have, yeah, no, dex, my dex is really good, I think. Yes. Yeah. Okay, uh, uh, 19. Nice, you roll behind the couches, blood spurts everywhere. <laughs> She's covered in it. Uh, th thank you. No, that's wrong. Shit. Yeah, it's even, it's even higher. Th this is this is more right than this is. Oh, this is okay. Yeah, yeah. Why don't oh, you save is oh. seven? Oh, yeah. So it was higher. Yeah. Much higher. Okay, cool. Okay, fine. You, but you you succeeded, yes. so you're fine. Yeah. Either way, you you survived. You there succeeded at like, dodging blood. Uh, you're welcome. Attack Rock believes you should earn your life. No, no, people, no, all over your shit. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? I might kind of. Did you have a stroke? Now. Seriously. The people, they're all over your shit. Gotcha. Gotcha. Thank, thank you. <laughs> Attack Rock. It is, your hand. It, is a, it is a great disrespect to the soldiers and fighters of a city to open the gates when all of us would want to die on the walls. Okay. We need to get and, you out of here. Am I? Where, what? Are you what? <laughs> am I able to like kind of venture out and see if any of the other servants have an animosity towards? Sure. And just find out why? Yeah, go ahead and give me a perception check to see if any other servants are reacting to this. Oh. No, nope. uh, everyone seems very chill, very <laughs> relaxed. Super chill. Super chill. I'm not gonna go anywhere. I'm. If you would stay with me, that's fine. But leaving my compound would be inviting attack. You, you be your Turk, you sort of your plan. I understand that, but when I move, I'm the most That's weak. impressive. So you understood that. Oh, I'm starting to catch on. <laughs> Disembodied voice. Right. Uh, Look, we might be able to guard you better than your own guards can, but I can understand your potential discomfort with that. Allow me to merely present a proposal. This vote you're going to be having as a council, there's an alternative to opening the gates. We are aware of a secret way into the gnome heartland. Oh? Yes. A portal through which all of the Warforged are storming. And we are willing to travel through that portal and put an end to the Warforged invasion. And what do you doing this for? Why are you doing this? You're foreign dignitaries and such. Because we believe in the cause of justice and peace. And because maybe we want to tap a giant mana pool and restore some lost souls from an ancient artifact. That's not important. The important <laughs> thing is you need to buy your, continue to buy yourselves time by prolonging the siege as long as possible, not by uh, committing this fatal error of opening the city to an invading army. Okay. You'll be decimated. <laughs> I understood that one. I'll be decimated. I got that. The, the people of Perlamore de deserve a good leader, and they deserve 
a, a good life, they deserve to be safe, they deserve to be comfortable. Was something that Attack Rock was told once. <laughs> <laughs> well, Attack Rock, uh, whoever told you that has good values, and I would welcome their counsel. <laughs> 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 if only they were here. <laughs> Tell you what, stay with me for the time. Come with me in my carriage as my personal bodyguards and envoys. Wow. And we will go to the meeting together. Okay. Yes. Yes. Very good. Is that amenable to you? Yes, that is very yeah. amenable to us. I make sure that we hold the, I, the, I pretend I can't get the door shut to the carriage just to let a tusk get in. Oh, okay. <laughs> Thank you for tuning in to another episode of Saving Throw Live. This is going to be our first episode of an actual campaign. No more one-shots. 